Every day, nearly 2,000 people come through the doors of the Berkey Creamery at University Park. And on football weekends, the number is even greater. The Creamery is a favorite destination of many Penn State students, alumni, and visitors. Port Matilda resident Carrie Sharkey is the mother of a former Penn State student. She says the Creamery was such a big part of her eldest daughter's college years that she had to serve it at her wedding. My daughter, who graduated from Penn State last year, is getting married in August, and she actually um, has chosen to have Penn State represented at her um, reception by having a Penn State ice cream bar. As customers devour their ice cream, they are probably too occupied with its taste to think about the effort that was put into its production. Rebecca Ziegler is a staff assistant at the creamery, and she says starting from the cow, the ice cream making process itself takes about a week. The ice cream making process is about a two-day process between pasteurization, modulization, um, all of the freezing and adding in things. It's about two days. We generally say that from cow to cone, from milking to serving, is a seven-day time span. Every gallon of ice cream is tested, processed and sold on site. And the sole purpose of the creamery is for the educational value it provides. Whether it's working with cows a mile away on the Penn State dairy farm or processing milk in the food science lab. The sole purpose of the creamery truly is to support the food science department. We are here to promote research and scholarships and to, you know, to be a financial support for staffing and, and that kind of support the food science department. The combined skills and dedication of Creamery employees and the entire Penn State Food Sciences program has made Penn State nationally renowned in the field of dairy production. Thanks to the success of this program, people like the founders of Ben & Jerry's Ice Cream got their start right here at Penn State. So next time you stop by the Creamery, remember that the hard work and innovative research is what makes every scoop of ice cream so delicious. From the cow to the cone. Reporting in Center County, I'm Greg Zahowski.